Hey guys, we're back here in Raleigh, North Carolina with EG StarCraft 2. We've got Bryce, Machine Bates, and Jeff in control Robinson. Unfortunately, they got seated against each other in the first round. Now, not an ideal situation, but let's hear some thoughts on that. Uh, obviously, it's always upsetting having to play a teammate, especially when we only have four teammates in a 64-man tournament. But, uh, you know, we're, we're working our way through it, and it is what it is. We can't change it. Okay, now Jeff, you, you came out the, out the victor two to zero. Do you think that it was that it was appropriate for them to, to seed you two together and then not reverse their decision with random seeding in effect? You know, it's it's MLG's first shot, so there's going to be mistakes, and that's understandable. Uh, in my opinion, what they should have done is randomized it the way they did, looked at that and said, hmm, EG in control, EG machine, that doesn't feel right. Nobody else is being treated that way. Perhaps we should change that. And I would have liked to have seen that decision get made, but then they announced it, and once an organization announces something like that, they can't go back on it because it makes them look bad. It's a circumstance, and I wish they would have reverse it, yeah, absolutely. Now, I guess, uh, unfortunate circumstances aside, let's talk about the game a bit. How do you feel it went for you? Uh, I don't know, I think I played pretty well overall. He, uh, you know, he outplayed me, deserved to, to get the victory, but I think overall it was closer than a 2-0 series. All right, now, Jeff, how did you feel about the two games? Well, you know, one of the unfortunate things about playing your teammate is I know exactly how he plays. Like, so if I play a slush or somebody else, a very good Zerg, I don't get to take, like, abusive uh, cuts in my play because I'm not sure that they're going to do this. But with Machine, I work with him, I play with him, we talk about the game all the time. So, you know, instead of going Citadel and, and faster upgrades or going Templar perhaps, I knew to just go straight to Colossus because he's a very solid player, he doesn't do anything gimmicky, and once I got to the Colossus I just kind of pushed him back into his base and that was that. I mean it's just unfortunate because I knew exactly how he plays. Alright, thanks a lot Jeff. Best of luck to the both of you in your next matches in the upcoming hours. Stay frosty, guys. Stay tuned to myeg.net for more coverage here from MLG Rally. We've got LZ Gamer and Inca coming right up.